Okay, hello everybody, it is Super Stupidy, and I am back with some more Metroid Prime Remastered. Anyway, is there anything fun in the water in this room? I can't remember, but I feel like there's not. I feel like there's nothing fun in the water down here. Okay, anyway, with that in mind, where do we want to go? Sun Chamber is done. Sun Tower. Hive Totem is done. Ruined Gallery. Uh, is done. Okay. So, all of this stuff that we don't need. This. Okay, so we gotta head back to the Tower of Light. Which is right behind me. I mean, it isn't. It's on the other end of here. Which is good. We'll take a little detour through here, which is exactly what we want to be doing. And I think that'll be it for Chozo Ruins, once we do those two things. Once we do this and that, I think that'll be it for the Chozo Ruins. If I recall correctly. So, let's get to it. Do a little backward and go in here. Jump, 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 no, jump. <laughs> get me in here. Yep, ah, ja. <laughs> Leave me alone. Alright, we've got a couple of items to pick up. And actually, I think... This room might hold the remaining Chozo lore. These rooms up over here. Alright, so first things first, we're gonna want to morph ball. To where is it? This isn't it. It must be on the other end of the room. Otherwise, I'm misremembering things. This is a pretty cool room. I like the little waterfalls here. Water toxicity levels returning to safe levels. Bah! Bah! Um, yeah. I like all the little details in this game. It's what really makes it for me. I love how memorable all of it is. Uh, okay. Let's swing across here. Do I have power bombs? I have four of them. I don't remember picking up a power bomb expansion. I've just been going in autopilot. But anyway, we have another one. When the heck did I get a power bomb expansion? Power bomb expansion acquired. Anyway, a Chozo lore. All right, one more Chozo lore, and that's a hundred percent Chozo lores. Chozo's lores. Is this the room? It is the room. All right, so we're gonna want to roll underneath here and grab a missile expansion. Right underneath this leafy bit here. Okay, so that's two expansions down. We got the bush one, and we got, uh, and we got the the wall one. The wall one with the lore. Anyway, we've got a couple more expansions along this path to pick up. As well as these guys, of course, to deal with. That's the wrong one. Boom! Oh, double whammy! I timed that one intentionally. I, it wasn't intentional. It was neat, though. Uh. Donk! Just broke his jaw. Just busted that jaw right off. Couldn't believe what just happened. Um, alright. Anyway, in order to complete the puzzle here, we're going to... I don't remember. I guess the, it was showing me in the cutscene that you're supposed to, to go up this half pipe. Right into the mouth. Go on. Uh-oh, gotta go. Ugh, ugh. What? It's fast. Where is my thingy? Okay, fine. I'll do this one. This is just gonna unlock the path out. Alright, can I... Yeah. Stinking. There's no... The momentum in this game is kind of stupid and it sucks. Alright, how do I get over there quickly? Just like that. Just forget the morph ball. Morph ball's stupid. Whoa, I forgot all the buttons. I forgot all the controls. Okay, here we go. Give me my energy tank. Yes, energy tank. Alright. So that's that. That was the wrong button. Um, Now we can go right in here. 
Now we can go right in here, I said. Ah, uh, there's pistons and it's smushing me. Let me out. Let me out. I like the red glow. Very nice. <laughs> This reminds me of that part in Metroid Prime Hunters, except that part in Metroid Prime Hunters is cool because if you screw up, you die instantly. <laughs> and that makes it very memorable. <laughs> um, anyway, I don't think that's what I was meant to do. I think I was meant to use this. <laughs> anyway. Yo. Yeah. All right. Anyway, I'm still missing one Chozo lore. I don't know where it is. That's probably fine. Okay, anyway, I believe that's the Chozo Ruins complete. Leave me alone. So, where to go now? Do we go down to Magmore Caverns and deal with that? Probably that seems like a good idea. I don't even know if there- oh yeah, there is still stuff. Oh wait, no, I forgot about this. I'm a dodo. I completely forgot about that. We had to do that first. Chozo Ruins shall be complete shortly. But first... This way, I've already been through here uh, too many times, <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and speed up for a minute. Alright, we're back in here. Now we're just going to dive into the water, run through here, jump up here, hop up here, grab our artifact. Alright, Chozo Artifact acquired. The Artifact of Life Giver, the fifth of twelve. Alright, we're knocking them out one by one. Just a few more. Just a few more to go. Three to be exact. Um, so, we're gonna move along now and head to Magmore Caverns. Alright, I was thinking about what I actually had left to do in Magmore Caverns, and I believe the answer is actually nothing. Uh, because I just went through the whole area tr to get the plasma beam, and um, that would have given me a perfectly good opportunity to clean up everything, since there aren't any plasma beam doors in there, and you don't need the phase on beam for anything. Anyway, little ice here, a little bit of ice so we can break. Uh, a lot of Fendrana Drifts is going to be basically all that remains. See ya for all the, s for the secrets here. Boom. Boom. Crystal Light gets the flamethrower. Uh, not the actual flamethrower ability, just, you know, torched with my amazing fire beam. Um, anyway, now that we're back here, we can go ahead and knock this down. Bonk. Um, I want to see something. Yeah, it works. It's actually kind of easy to do the rapid-fire missile thing. Uh, I'm not that, that good at it, though. Um, anyway. <laughs> so, now we can roll in here and go up. Yeah. Missile expansion acquired. Oof. Um, Alright, so now with that under our belt, we can carry on into this place. Into this place. Get out of the way. I hate you. I hate you. Uh, uh. Oof. Alright, so let's get to the top of this room. There isn't anything cool down here. Nothing cool in between here and the top. Uh... Just take as many shortcuts as possible. Climb. Jump. Jump. These guys, would you shut up? You're so obnoxious. Boom. Yeah, 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 yeah. It makes you very angry that I have a charge beam. That's fine. Just stay out of my way. Anyway, now that we have the plasma beam, we can unfreeze this.
Nice. Don't mind if I just cuddle up. Oh, spooky. Ugh. What is it? Artifact. Chozo artifact acquired. This is the artifact of Sun, the ninth of twelve. Just two more. Just two more to go. All right. Let's carry on. Let's carry. Where am I going? Let's carry on. Let's head back. Um. So yeah, that's it for this area, particular area of Fendrana Drifts. I'm going to be speeding up again. Big Shigoth. Good thing I have the plasma beam and can kill him easily. Easily. Alright, anyway. Our missile expansion, I can hear. I can hear it. It's around here. Frozen into ice. Huh? <laughs> Mine. Nice. Alright, got that one. Now we have one more in this general area, I believe. Ugh. Die. No, no. Da, da, ah, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Shwink. Um, okay. Boom, boom. Now, is it up here? It is up here. They're both in the same room. I always thought they were separate, but I guess I forget that every time I play this game because I'm a total idiot. Um, alright. I think that's all of the special things for this area. So... Uh, yeah, I guess we'll move on. Move on in here. Uh, in here, right? Is this where we want to go? Du -du -du. We want to end up... I guess we should find our next objective. Nothing to do in here. Chapel of Elders. This is the area we were just in. So we're going to be making our way in here. Um... Yeah, there's an item in here that I haven't collected, I believe, right over here. This little morph ball tunnel on the other end. So we can do that. Um, should probably be the next thing. Unless I want to do that last and then we can hit this. Maybe. Seems like a good idea. So if I go in this way... Go straight through the purple door. Research entrance. Go in here. Come up here. This is where we'll get our next artifact. In this room. And I can also double check to make sure if I missed any pirate logs in here for some reason. Um, and then, we'll be spat out in here. Not a bad idea. And we'll go through all this. Collect up all the things we needed the plasma beam for. And then we'll come back this way, go in here, grab this, circle back around, go down, and, uh, carry on. Alright. Oops, I forgot about this one. I knew there was a reason to be in this room. Um, I gotta get on top. Okay, we'll climb up here. We'll climb up here, jump up here, jump over here. Get ready, because we gotta drop through. Boom! <laughs> we gotta drop in here. Oh, it's a power bombs. Oh, it's a power bombs. Alright. Anyway, I completely forgot about that one. Haha, <laughs> my bad. I found one. I found a log that I missed. Ha ha ha. Okay. Uh, that's one of them. I guess that means theoretically... Is that the first one that I missed? Or is it... The, oh. I guess I should scan it again to figure out which one it was. I should have paid more attention. Because I get, I get... I don't know how they're ordered, but if they're put in a w such a way that they come one after the other and that should tell me okay so I got the phase on program just now just now um 
Uh, so, theoretically, the next one is coming up somewhere. Alright, anyway, uh, where are the pirates? All you have to do once you get the plasma beam is tag them once and they'll overheat and die after a certain amount of time. So that's pretty fun, stupid idiots. <laughs> oh, oof! Um, <laughs> so the flying pirates are no longer a threat at all. Uh, that and a single charge beam is going to instantly incinerate them, so there's that as well. Oof! Anyway, now that we're in this room, we can hop up here and find this. Boom! Using the plasma beam to break this thing, this window that I accidentally just broke, it's gonna- Hello? Stop! Please! Move! What's wrong with this? There it goes. Anyway, it's gonna expose this thing, which we can missile. Alright, nice. Let's get in there. Oof. Go, go down. Go down. Get me in here. Get me. What? Why does the camera flip like that and then reverse your controls? What a stupid design. Chozo artifact acquired. The third of twelve. Alright, just one more. And we're at 95% scans and 92% items. All right, let's get out of here. What's going on? Why can't I? I guess I gotta go up this way, huh? I gotta go up this way. Roll, roll, roll. Wee! All right, spat me out. Anyway, this is the correct way. All right, let's go this way. See if I can find any remaining pirate logs. I don't remember if there's anything scary in this room. Anything bad, or is it all Metroids that I can just freeze and kill? Easy. I wish it wasn't stinking dark. I can't see a thing. Where the heck am I? <clears throat> Die. Die. Definitely makes looking for logs trickier. Okay, um... So yeah, where's my log gonna be? Where is it? I know it's in here. I know it's in here somewhere. I have no idea where the final Chozo lore is, though. Hmm... Ah! There it is! Aha! I found it! Alright, well if that's the case, if I only have one Chozo lore to find, then I'll probably- if I can't find it by the end of the game, uh, which it seems like I might not, since I already left the Chozo Ruins and probably won't be heading back. Um, unless there's one that I just, like, totally forgot about. Um, uh, I guess I'll do a little looking around online, because there aren't that many Chozo lores to find. Um, so, it should be pretty easy to figure out which one I accidentally forgot. The pirate logs are a bit different because they all look the same. Like all the areas look the same because they're all just kind of metallic and bleh. Which is like fine, like it's just uh, kind of tough to tell them apart sometimes. Um, so yeah, uh, if I got all the pirate data, then I'll, I'll go and look for the remaining Chozo lore online unless I find it on my own. Anyway... Uh, with that out of the way, I don't need to spend any more time in here. I can just go right through the ice beam door. Get me out of here! Go through this way. We're gonna pop up. Oh. I didn't... I didn't go... Through the right door. Oops. What happened? I meant to... No, that's the right door. I just meant to be over here. Okay, well fine, we'll get that energy tank last. So, which way are we gonna go? Are we gonna go up and loop down? I guess we should probably go down and loop up. That's the way, no wait, up and loop down. Yeah, that's the way you're intended to go through it the first time. Okay.
All right, here we go. You again. Get, get, I can't aim with the stupid controller. <laughs> uh, it's so hard without the Wii Remote. Why? I want my Wii Remote back. Anyway, could I kill the glider? No, he's invincible. Okay, so, is there, what is there to do? There's this, there's this. Boom. All right, how do you get this one out? I always forget. It's either dropping a stalactite or it's using the plasma beam on something. What is it? Is it... Or maybe it's neither. Maybe it's something else that I completely forgot about. Guess I ought to use a scan visor, huh? Don't see it. Don't see it. I'm pretty sure... It's a stalactite? It's not a stalactite? How does it work? I always forget how to get this one. Power bomb. Power bomb. It's not power bomb. Boom. It's too dark. It's too dark. You would think with the amount of times I've played through and 100%ed this game that I would stinking remember this stuff. Hey. <laughs> um. It's gotta be a stalactite. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. It's hidden. Okay. Uh, so I guess you can only hit it after using the glider to swing across. So, I guess that's what we're going to do. Yeah. Alright. Let's knock this baby down. Where is There it is. Ah! I missed, apparently. Is it not falling? This is the world's stupidest game. Where's the target? It, the cursor doesn't light up at any point. Where's the target? Okay, there's no way it can miss if I use my super missile! Never mind. Stupidest game of all time. Why doesn't it work? Why doesn't it stinking work? Do I need to switch control schemes to make this work? I don't understand- there it is. <laughs> I don't understand where the target is. It's not clear. Alright. Look, I missed. Ugh. I get- go th- get- please. Please. Where is- there it is. Alright. Give it to me. Finally. Finally. That took longer than all the other items collected this episode put together. Uh, speaking of which, I suppose I should probably end the episode around here. Next episode, we'll finish up Fendrana Drifts, collect that last Chozo data, finish up, like, the Talon Overworld and stuff. I'm getting real close to the end, though. Um, and I guess head over to the Impact Crater to finish things once and for all. Anyway, hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. If you have, go ahead and do the usual supportive stuff. And I will see you guys for the next one. So from Super Stupidity, it is goodbye for now. Goodbye.